We now have the ability to create AI generated images directly in PowerPoint using Copilot. So let's have a look how to do that. First of all, uh, from the Home tab, I'm going to click on the Copilot button, and that will bring up the Copilot sidebar. And we have a prompt here create an image. When I click on that one, it's putting the start of that prompt in for me. Generate an image of. Here's one I created earlier. Generate an image of an Irish red setter dog running through a field of long grass. I can hit enter to send that prompt and Microsoft will work on that for a few moments for me. What I have found is that the more descriptive I am with the prompts, the better the responses are. If I were to put create an image of a dog running through a field, it might be quite cartoon like because there's more content out there for cartoon dogs. Dog is not specific enough. But when I put in a breed, I'm then getting very realistic type images back. I can drag the sidebar over so I can see those images in a little bit more uh, detail. So I've got four options there. Don't like the grass on that one. That doesn't look great. Uh, let's have a look at these top two. Um, quite like this one here. So I can select the image and then click on the insert button. That'll bring the image in for me. And when I click on play, I can now see I've got quite a realistic picture of a red setter running through long grass. One of the things I find is that the images coming in square. I haven't been able to work out how to get them to be aspect ratio of 16 by 9. Hopefully that will, will be coming soon. We can use the designer feature in PowerPoint to give us options. What it tends to do if it stretches the image out to be full screen is it tends to cut off some of the content because we've gone from square to uh, landscape. So that's not ideal. But I'd love to know if you're using this feature and if you are, how are you finding it? Thank you. Bye.